Hey guys, this is the last assignment for the week. We're gonna be working grammar and composition two, work text page 170. So please get that out. Just one page of work here. It's, it's got a lot of things on it though. We've already done the first few. Identify the part of speech of the italicized words as noun, pronoun, or adjective. Okay, just have those three, noun, pronoun, adjective. So we can handle that. All right, number four, all over the world. Well, A, N, and D are called articles. They're always adjectives. Most people, how many people? Well, that's an adverb. Um, sorry, that's adjective. Which one, what kind, how many, how much, and whose? So, um, they do not know many of the basic facts. Many is a pronoun, facts is his antecedent, or many is the, uh, um, it represents a certain number of them at least. So yeah, many is a pronoun. Um, their coffee, that's an adjective. Whose coffee? Their coffee. Even though people use the common term, uh, that number eight is adjective as well. Common, what, uh, what kind of term? A common term. Coffee does not come from a bean. Nine is a noun. The thing. Coffee is brewed from the seeds or pits of the coffee plant. Pits is a noun as well. There are two types. How many types? Two types. It's an adjective. Some drink coffee. Some is a pronoun. Some is a pronoun just like many is a pronoun. Made from the Arabica beans, but it, that's a pronoun, is actually the robusto beans, that's an adjective. What kind of beans? Robusto beans, which are stronger. Um, that's an adjective as well, stronger. And contain more caffeine, adjective again, lots of them. How, how much caffeine? More caffeine. Uh, let's see, that was 16, so 17. Coffee is the top agricultural export. That's an adjective. What kind of export? Agricultural export in the world. It is a pronoun. Is traded and sold more than any other commodity in the world except for oil. Uh, that's a noun. It's a thing. Most beans are still green. That's an adjective. When they are traded, and the roasting procedures. What kind of procedures? Roasting procedures, that's an adjective. Incidentally, roasting, to roast something is usually a verb, but since it is an ing, well, since it is not being used as a verb, but it's being used as an adjective, we call that a participle. Uh, number 22. They're guard, closely guarded industrial secrets. What kind of secrets? Industrial, that's an adjective, but secrets is a noun. One likes, one stands in for a person, whoever that is, so that's a pronoun. Likes his coffee, whose coffee is an adjective. Okay. Now, write eight original sentences using the following words as instructed. Okay, well, I'm gonna write some, yours will be different. James as an adjective, okay. Let's see. Let, we'll have to use whose, which one, what kind, how many, how much, whose, so James's. So let's see, um, that is 
James apostrophe S dog. Table as a noun. Um, save me a seat at your table. Table is an adjective. Um, don't feed my dog table food. What kind of food? Table food. Those as a pronoun. Um, those books belong, no, that would be as an adjective, those books belong to Shelley. Um, I enjoy, um, let's say, I enjoy John's, um, let's see, I need a, I need a thing, a thing that he owns. I enjoy John's, um, Let's see, something that I enjoy. I enjoy John's um, toys more than those. Assuming I'm demonstrating, I'm talking about a, some toys that are here or over there. I'm demonstrating it. Those are demonstrative pronouns or that is a demonstrative pronoun, either as a pronoun. Um, uh, let's see. Of the twins, I Appreciate either. So either uh, is a pronoun and the twins, one or the other twin, they both individually are the antecedents. And either is an adjective. Um, let's see. Either twin has my vote. I guess we'll say that. So this and that are the same. We're going to change this one. I'm looking for I, I uh, ended up re rewriting that I, I was thinking I was wrong but I wasn't if you look either choice um, if you're if you're using it as an you can use a pronoun or something that's like the word either an indefinite pronoun to be to function as an adjective in this case which is what we did, either twin. See that either twin? But I appreciate either. Either stands in for a twin in this case. So that is either as a pronoun. I had it right. I just didn't. Uh, 
I got I second guessed myself. Oops. Sometimes you have to do that though to make sure that you're right. All right, guys. Thank you so much. Um, we are finished with these exercises for the week. I appreciate all your hard work. Get that uh, turned in, and I will see you next time. Have a great one.